Hey guys, so today I'm doing something that I've been meaning to do for a long, 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 long time. It is a Vixen Fitness gym haul. So Vixen Fitness is my clothing range. It's a female fitness range, which I started a couple years ago, and I've just been growing it since then. When I first started, it was just um, hats and like printed t-shirts, and now obviously I've got to the point where I can be making seamless tops and leggings and everything like that, so it's very exciting, but I just want to talk about it on here and just show you the stuff that I have with me in Australia and the stuff that I love and yeah, just some of the different products, so it'll help you when you want to buy them. I should have been doing this like all the time whenever a new collection came out but I didn't really have somewhere to record it back in England but now with this room it's a bit more spacious and yeah so it's just a good space for me to do it so the stuff isn't brand new it's stuff that I've been wearing so that'll be quite good because you can sort of see what it looks like after you know being worn quite a lot of times so at least that'll be useful in that sense as well so I wanted to talk about why I started Vixen. It's actually back four years ago when I first had the idea. I was working with Vanquish Fitness on Body Power. I've worked with them every year, I absolutely love them. And the two guys who own it were a year younger than me and they were just amazing, like what they had achieved and I just thought, wow, it was so inspiring. So I then was looking around Body Power and at the time there wasn't loads and loads and loads of different girls stuff. So I thought, oh like, this is great and I'll get into that because Vanquish mainly just did guy stuff as well so I thought there's a big market here where I can create nice clothes for girls however by the time I got Vixen up and running there was loads of girls <laughs> gym ranges like it is ridiculous how many different brands there are out there I feel like every time I go on Instagram there's a new clothing range so it's a big market to compete in but you know I love it so just got to keep pushing through um, and now obviously Gymshark have a massive female thing like their female range is bigger than their guys now which wasn't the case back in the day and yeah so it's just exploded really yeah I started off like I said with the t-shirts and all that blah 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 and then I just kept building it up and funding it through my PT earnings and then I managed to bring out leggings my first ever leggings were my shape leggings and um, I did those in black and grey and I really loved those and then I moved on to my sculpt range, which was my biggest range, which is the colours, the pink, mint and grey. And that's kind of like the staple range, like they're always there. I just love them because colours are just beautiful, aren't they? When you have them in pictures, they just look so good and they really stand out. The pink ones are just amazing, the mint ones, I love them. The grey ones I love with like loads of stuff. I've got to the point now where I've done my seamless range recently and you know that was a really big thing. I've been wanting to do seamless for ages so I was really excited when I managed to get that out and then I got the shorts out because I was moving to Australia so I was like well I need to get shorts out because I need to train in shorts and I want to train in Vixen so Vixen needs to be bringing out some shorts. So I got those done and now I am doing getting some more samples for the next range. Getting a few different things. I want to get some jumpers even though I'm not going to be using them out here because you know it's getting hot and hot, hotter here but for England I like still want to be keeping with the season and just some more leggings, different colours and different styles. So yeah, exciting things to come. But yeah, let me take you through what I already have, the products that I have, I'll talk you through the fabrics, the sizing and just show you how they look. Thanks for joining me. So these are the main ones I brought out with me. I'm wearing the black one of these so that's why it's not out but I've got the leopard print set. Oh, I'm wearing the leopard sports bra so that's why that's not with that and um, the seamlesses all the different colors with the short top and the long tops and then the sculpt frame I don't have the black one here though um, I think it's in the wash and I've got the Cerulean shorts and then these are actually the first leggings I ever brought out these are the shape leggings and I absolutely just love those so I still wear those all the time so the first outfit I'm going to go through is the Serene range and this is the dusty pink. So this pink looks really, really nice with a tan. I'm quite pale, like I'm out here in Australia trying to get a real tan so, you know, it takes a while being ginger and all. I really like this fabric. It's very, very soft but I'll go through that a bit more at the end. But the shorts, I love the length of them. The, these ones are a bit longer than the black ones which you'll see. I'm not sure why the lengths are kind of different but they both come just below the glutes. These ones just seem to sit a little bit lower. You can see on the back it's got that scrunch effect which really helps define the glutes and just gives it a much nicer shape. And then you can see here as I'm squatting, just showing that these are completely squat proof. You cannot see anything through with these fabrics so they're really good. And then here you have the crop top which sits just below a sports bra so it's a nice length, gives you a good gap between that and the shorts. 
I like to mix the different tops with the black shorts because I just think they look really nice. The pink and black go really nice together. And I'll wear this pink top with leggings and out to the shops and stuff like that. Here you've got the blue with the black shorts. So you don't always just have to wear the same colour together. So now we're moving on to the blue. Now this is a really nice bright blue. This is the first one I got as a sample because I just love the colour. I just think it's beautiful, like really stands out. I want to get these in leggings as well, but for now it's just the shorts. And again here, just doing the squat test, so you can see they're completely thick, this fabric. You can't see anything through them, which is what I love about them so much as well. Moving on to the black set. This one's probably my favourite, just because you can wear it with anything, and I love to mix and match it. So you can see the black is a little bit shorter, as I was saying. Maybe I just need to pull them down, I'm not sure. But yeah, they seem to just sit a tiny bit shorter than the other ones. The top I love to wear all the time because it looks really nice with leggings and a checkered shirt and it's just a really nice casual outfit to wear out. Next we have our leopard print set. So I'll just show you the sports bra with the shorts quickly just because I love this look. So every sports bra that Vixen sells all come with removable padding so it's up to you if you want to wear them or not. I always wear them because I've only got small boobs so I kind of need them. And the straps at the back are adjustable as well which is really good so you can make it as tight as you want. And again just showing you with the black shorts how squat proof they are. And now with the snow leopard leggings to match, so you can see them both together. These leggings are a very different material. They're a lot thinner and a bit more silky than the rest of the things that I sell, but they are very breathable and comfortable to train in. The print is really, really nice. I love the way it looks and the shape. It's got a little bit of that V on the back there as well to help shape the glutes as well, which is nice. These ones aren't as squat proof as the other ones just because they're white obviously so you do need to be a bit more careful but as long as you wear nude knickers you shouldn't really have a problem with them. Here I'm just showing you the Snow Leopard sports bra with the shape leggings. So these are the shape leggings, the first ever leggings I had out. These are one of my favourite ones, I love the material. The material is similar to the Snow Leopard leggings but it's thicker. So it's got a bit more support and coverage. Obviously it's black as well, so it's darker. But yeah, these ones have a very tiny subtle scrunch on the back. You can't really notice it, especially because these are old now, so it's like faded out. But the scrunch is really nice because it's subtle, so it's not in your face. So people who find scrunch ones a bit too much and over the top, these ones are good because they still have the same sort of effect with the V, like they help shape your glutes but it's not too out there if you don't feel comfortable. And again, doing the squat test, I just always wear black knickers with this one and yeah, I've never really had any issues with it. Next, we have the seamless range. This is probably my favorite range to be fair. Well, this blue one in particular, because I just absolutely love the color and the seamless is just so comfortable. Like you could just live in the leggings. They're just, yeah, like you could wear them to bed around the house. They are that comfortable. The leggings have a little bit of a design on them. And then I've just got the Fox logo matching on the leggings and the sports bra. The design goes round the back and makes a little V-shape to help give you a little bit of a curve on the glutes. Something I really want to talk about here is the suction on the waistline. It is incredible. And you'll notice as I squat, it doesn't get that gap that you sometimes find with other seamless leggings. This one literally just stays stuck to your back. It's incredible. That's why I love them so much as well. And here just doing the squat test. So the section where there's the dots, that bit can be less squat proof than the other bit. So again, just make sure you wear nude knickers and you'll be fine. I love the long sleeve crop top. I love the length of it, the feel of it. And they have the thumb holes as well, which I've always, always loved. And then on the back, there's a netted area. So it just gives your back a little bit of air and it's just cute. Here we've got the short sleeve crop top. So it's exactly the same as the other leggings. It's just that the long sleeve's been cut off and we've made it into short for you. I actually got the short sleeves done because of the fact I was moving to Australia. So I wanted to be able to have that short sleeve option because I knew the long sleeves would be way too much for me. And here, yeah, you've just got them in gray and then we've got the burgundy as well. The dark grey is really nice. Dark grey is actually a bit more popular than the blue, which I was surprised at. I think people just feel more comfortable in dark colours normally. I always love to match grey with pink. So this pink jumper and grey leggings is something I like to wear a lot. 
So now moving on to the burgundy and just to show you again how you can mix and match these colours, you don't have to wear all in one. I quite like the burgundy with the dark grey leggings. So here is another look I love, matching the seamless long sleeves to the leggings and yeah I love this colour combination, the burgundy with the grey leggings. I also love the blue top with the grey leggings as well, that's a really nice way to wear it. And here we are onto our sculpt range now, so this is our all grey. This is one of my favourites because again it goes with a lot of stuff and it's just really cute. This fabric is really really comfortable as well and the back's done in a sort of V so it gives you a nice shape around the glutes as well but without the scrunch. So just doing the squat test for you here. So these ones are really good again. I've actually worn dark knickers with the grey before and I haven't had any issues with it. So another thing I love about this collection is that the sports bras can be worn in two different ways. So you can either have it longer for extra coverage or you can roll it under like I've done here and now it's a short sports bra and you wouldn't even be able to tell it's longer because there's an extra thick bit under the sports bra which you can just tuck it under so it's just perfect. You can wear it either way. Just showing you one of my favourite looks here which is the pink cropped sweater with the grey sculpt range and yeah I absolutely love this colour combination. The light grey with the baby pink just looks so beautiful. Moving on to the pink, I just wanted to show you as well how I like to mix these sports bras and leggings together. The pink, mint and green are all beautiful pastel colours so you can really mix between all of those and they look really nice together. And here you have the all pink. The pink is gorgeous, it just really stands out. It's such a beautiful shade. I've worn this probably more than anything else, to be fair. If you've got a photo shoot, or if you just wanna get some nice photos for something, for your page or Instagram, then this pink set is so the right way to go. This one just looks beautiful in photos. You get some really, really nice looks with it. And here you've got the sports bra up close, so you can see it's got really good coverage. Again, these all have removable padding, and it's got that cute little cross section at the top, and then you have the Vixen logo at the back. I just thought the Vixen looked like quite classy and just suited that collection a lot more than putting the Fox logo. And yeah, you can see how it rolls out really easily. This is what I like to call the mermaid set. So the combination of the pink and the mint is your little mermaid. So cute. And last but not least in the sculpt range, we have the mint set. I could never decide between the pink and the mint, which was my favourite to be fair. I'd wear the pink and it would be my favourite, and then I'd wear the mint and it would be my favourite. Again, this is another beautiful one for photos, and then, yeah, it's just gorgeous. But I love training in this, and yeah, it's just a really nice colour. It makes you feel so good about yourself, I think. This sculpt set comes in black as well, but I didn't have this out, and yeah, I didn't feel like I needed to put this on the video, because there's already so much for me to go through. Oh, I forgot to do the squat test with the other one. So here you go, here's the squat test with the mint. Again, just wear nude colours and you'll be fine. Okay, so I want to go through the fabrics. This seamless range is, I think, my favourite, to be fair. This blue one is my favourite. I would wear this all the time. I just feel so comfortable in it. So these ones can come with these little labels and I just always rip them out because I just find they itch you otherwise. So it's made from 76% polymede. 14% polyester and 10% spandex. With everything, I just make sure I don't tumble dry it because when you tumble dry it, it's not good for the logo and they can fade. Um, if I show you one of my old ones. So this I used to tumble dry before I realised. And you can sort of see it's coming apart. Whereas like this, I haven't. And that one's still completely fine. So you just have to watch out for stuff like that because... The way you wash things really determines how long they last and stuff. You just have to be careful with that. So, with these ones, they all have the fox. The same as these scrunch shorts. Same as the scrunch shorts. And the old shape leggings, which have it on the bottom. Now, the fox I love. I got it made, like, when I first started. Obviously, I got the logo done. But I'm actually having to change it because it is very similar to Alf alpha leets um wolf so i'm gonna have to change that so um hopefully you guys will not like the new logo i do really like it it's like a minimalist fox head and it looks more like a fox i suppose because i suppose this could be interpreted for a wolf or something like that whereas this one's maybe a bit more foxy but yeah i like it so hopefully you guys will like it and the change won't upset too many people the old sculpt ranges 
they all have Vixen on the back, like that. And the leggings, they just have Vixen. I just liked how simple it was and I just thought it looked quite classy like that. So that's why I had those ones done. The leopard print ones don't have any logo on, just because you've got the print all over them. Like you wouldn't even see the logo, so I didn't see the point. We've got the seamless fabric. Then the other fabric that we use is this one. So this one is 87% nylon and 13% spandex. These are really stretchy, really, really soft, very, very comfortable. You will find with some of the black ones, they don't feel as soft, which is really weird. The black sculpt, they are supposedly the same fabric, but they don't feel quite as soft as the colored ones do. I wanted to talk about these grey leggings in the sculpt range. Now, some of you may have noticed that these don't come in extra small on the website. We do have extra small, but we don't sell them on the website. And the reason for this is because the factory completely messed up when I ordered them. So when I got them, they hadn't sent me any extra smalls at all. Like they messed up the quantity and the sizes of what I wanted. So they then had to make extra smalls for me and send them to me. But because they made them after, they must have run out of this fabric and got another grey fabric thinking it was the same when it wasn't. So this is a small, medium and large. That's what they look like. The extra small looks like this. So it's slightly different if you can see that. And as well as the shade being different, the fabric feels different. They tell me it's the same fabric, but it's not. It's a lot thinner, um, but actually I prefer this on the extra small. Like it's really stretchy and really breathable. I actually love these and yes, I'm a bit gutted that that happened because this is actually a really nice fabric and I can't even sell it but if you do want extra small grey and you're not trying to match because the whole reason I don't have it on the website is because if people buy these wanting to match with the top it's not going to match so I can't do that to my customers I cannot sell that so if you do want the extra small and you're not getting it to match those, you just want the grey leggings, you can get these. Just DM direct message Vixen on Instagram or email us through our website and or Instagram and we can send you out an extra small. Just let us know, just buy one of the other sizes and we'll just send you this. So yeah, let us know because this is a really, really nice fabric. I love it. I actually wear this all the time with the pink jumper. They go so well together. So next, our other fabric is our shorts. So they're all slightly different. So these ones are so soft. Like, I can't even explain to you how soft these are. Like, I thought the sculpt set was soft. But when you get these shorts, oh my gosh, you could just live in these. I need to get these in leggings because I would wear these every day. They're amazing. So this is 85% polyester and 15% spandex suplex it says and yeah these are just lovely so you have the scrunch at the back it's a very very like in your face scrunch which is cool so it really defines the glutes these are just really soft lovely same with like the shorts in the other colors as well the shape leggings these ones are completely different as well so these oh look this is back in the day when vixen still had an e really old these ones so this is 78% nylon and 22% spandex so these are more I don't know if you'd say silky um yeah like silky fabric type thing I don't know how to describe it but not like a fabric material it's like a silk do you know what I don't know but these, I love these. I prefer wearing these shape leggings than the black sculpt, the ones in these. Even though the black sculpt is higher waisted, which I prefer, I just prefer the material on this. I think these feel a lot more comfortable to just go to town in, cinema, and just training, really. I just find these ones really, really nice. They're really breathable, and I could wear these every day. I have worn these every day, I'm not gonna lie. I work in a gym, so this is what I wear. And as you can see, I've had these ones for ages. The, the print on these ones are really quite strong. Like, it hasn't really faded at all. So those ones are really good, the, the logo print on that. They're like proper durable. And this one has a little pocket as well at the front. So you can put your card in, put a locker key in, whatever. 
the Sculpt sports bras come in a small, medium and large. And that's because you don't need an extra small in these. They are so supportive. They're so like tight that they're really good. Like an extra small just wouldn't, you just wouldn't need it. If you do have bigger boobs, I would recommend to size up in these because yeah, otherwise it's just going to be too tight. The scrunch shorts and serene top as well only come in a small, medium and large. And the small's kind of like extra small, small. So again, that's why I didn't bother doing extra small. Depending on how much room you like. If you're more to the, like the bigger end of a small, then maybe go to medium. Same with the tops as well. The seamless stuff, the same. They're really tight. Like when you first pull them out of the packet, you're like, oh my gosh, like how is this going to fit on me? But then you put them on because obviously they're so stretchy, they fit. But this, like I normally always wear an extra small in leggings. But this I wear a small because the small is basically like an extra small as well. The same as the other ones. So again, if you're bigger end of small, maybe go for mediums it just depends how tight you like things and how you like your fit so the snow leopard set these ones are really funny like i got these done with a different company and the sizing is just weird so i've had people wear them and buy their size and it fits them perfectly but then people try them on and they're just really tight like they don't fit them for me I get a small one they're absolutely fine like they fit me perfectly but i had someone who normally wears a large and they put the large on and they couldn't get them up over their legs so just be wary of that you might need to size up in these ones oh the material of the leopard ones is 95 percent polyester and five percent spandex so these ones are completely different these ones are a little bit like the shape leggings um the black ones but um thinner so a lot more thinner the sculpt range sizing so extra small small medium and large and it's true to size if you want extra small get an extra small if you're small get small if you're medium get medium what else and my resistance bands so this is the main one i use because this is like perfect size for everything and um, the purple ones are good if you're a bit bigger um because these can be really tight and then the mint one is really 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 tight so that's like you know proper if you want a really strong resistance against you like advanced intermediate whatever but yeah so this has the little vixen logo and yeah i love these i'm so glad i got these done and you can get these with they come with a free resistance um a free resistance bands guide it just tells you exactly how to use them it has pictures shows you different exercises and how to activate your glutes with them which is good I am making a new glute guide at the moment. So I already have one, but it's old. I made it a few years ago. So this one's gonna be new and improved, new photos, new exercises, a lot more workouts in it. I only put two programs in the last one, so I'm gonna do more for this one. And it's just got everything you need to know about training your glutes. And it's gonna come with the resistance band guide as well, so that you have both of those. And then you'll literally you've got everything you need to know about building your glutes. And that's gonna come out maybe next week so keep your eyes peeled for that on my instagram and the website and you'll be able to get that and i'm going to do packages as well so you can get the glute guide with a resistance band or with all of the resistance bands or whatever so yeah thank you guys so much for watching this i hope it has been useful i've been a bit rubbish where i haven't really put much about vixen on my youtube just because i don't know i don't want to be like in people's faces with it but yeah i need to do more and yeah, I hope it was useful. I hope you guys like it and like some of the products and purchase some. That would help me out. I have had a few new samples in of some more stuff. So hopefully within the next few months, we will have some more products coming in. Then I can do another Vixen haul on that. And that stuff will be brand new and out there to show you guys. So thank you so much. If you have any questions for me, any questions about any of the Vixen stuff, like sizing products, anything like that, please let me know. Um, because yeah, I'm obviously here to help. And yeah, thank you again. I'll see you next time. Bye.